coming out of the hospital where Kate Middleton was treated for abdominal surgery. Let's go straight to the royal editor of the Daily Mirror, Russell Myers. Russell Myers, what have you got for us? Well, morning, guys. Well, shocking story developing tonight. We've just broken on our website is that uh, there is an internal investigation that has been launched at the London Clinic in Marylebone, where the Princess of Wales was a patient in January, uh, undergoing abdominal surgery. And the reason is that there is allegations that a member of staff uh, accessed her private medical records. Now, this, of course, follows all the sort of uh, crazy speculation and conspiracy theories that we've been seeing over the last few weeks. But uh, a major probe described to me tonight as a major security breach. OK, so is it likely, given that this person had access, that the information is going to get out? Well, listen, Kensington Palace and indeed the Princess of Wales have been uh, extremely guarded about the nature of uh, surgery. Uh, we, we heard when she was uh, um, admitted to hospital that she didn't wish to talk about the reasons why she was having the abdominal surgery. I mean, sources have told me that it's something that she may wish to discuss in the future, but it is a private medical matter. Now, in the UK, accessing private medical records, whether you belong to the NHS or a private institution, is against the law. Now, I've spoken to the Metropolitan Police tonight. They haven't confirmed that they are involved, but this internal probe is still ongoing at the hospital, and, uh, and one may wonder where it will end up. And it's certainly um, a, a shocking state of events, mm. not only for the hospital that has treated Terrible. members of the royal family, prime mm. ministers, presidents and uh, well-known celebrities. And uh, so far, with an unblemished record over decades, it's a, it's, a, it's a big one for them to answer tonight. Yeah, and I guess one would wonder also how long the palace has known about this. Obviously, we saw that video we're looking at now, just released yesterday, the Prince William coming out as well, talking about Kate just overnight. Well, certainly the palace are aware of the uh, of the allegations and uh, that they wouldn't comment on the record, but I understand that they were made aware by hospital bosses as soon as this became apparent. Um, the, the investigation involves at least one member of staff. So it could be more, but uh, I'm told it's just at least one member of staff at this stage. And I think there's huge, huge questions, you know, for the hospital. The London I Clinic, see. as I said, have, have, um, have uh, dealt with members of the royal family, including the late Queen, Prince Philip. They've, uh, they've treated prime ministers. John F. Kennedy was treated there back in the 70s. It's somewhere where you would absolutely ex expect the, uh, the absolute height of privacy. Mm. And for this to have happened on their watch, I think there's serious questions for the uh, hospital uh, tonight. Look, um, just um, before we go, I mean, those personal details are, are exactly that. Mm. Uh, but does the palace, knowing that something could come out, get in front of it? Um, how do they play that and then, and then risk it coming out? What do they do? Well, I think, you know, their, their, their position still stands because it is at its base Kate's private medical yeah. matter and she has decided not to talk about it. When she wants to, if she decides to, will be on her terms and her terms mm. only. So I think that this is not only an issue for the hospital but an issue for the palace as well and I'm sure they will want to, uh, you know, go through the, um, the, the investigation as the, as the hospital concludes it. Mm, it's very ugly, isn't it? Awful. Rusty, thank you. Brooke. Hey there, Today fans. Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my God. Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our <laughs> YouTube channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?